Hello, welcome back to uh, the more of the thingies. <laughs> That's the more of the thingies. Keeps happening. So let's go through the message log. First thing, conjuration done for me. I died. Battle that you had that wasn't very interesting. <laughs> I guess it was a curb stop. <laughs> As usual, just more fucking province defense. Boring. Well, there goes another nerfy territory. Mm-hmm. I think he only has one left. Mm-hmm. Fucking weak ass some bitch. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Technically this is an army, but it's a very small army. That's just me pushing uh, in there. Yeah, it's a very, very small army. It's like two guys he was recruiting because he's a knucklehead. Uh one guy, that's kinda of funny. Must have been an archer who ran away. Yeah. Oh wait, you took that little island finally, hmm? Saw that one. Now this one is a, a big old Carlita sadness. Big battle in Batane. Oh yeah, that one, yeah. We do have one good battle that's worth watching at the very least. Boop. Oh. Just gotta give it a quick pause, cause uh, that's just my recording Thing he's stuttering because I don't I disabled the game capture. Hmm. I was doing a stream the other day, so that's why oh. we did that. Oh my Oh. Kib's out here ruining all the videos. At least he hit record this time. Still waiting for the damn thing to There we go. Don't worry about it. That's uh <laughs> not mentioning that. Okay, so you're lightening the ever living shit out of Carlos for being a piece of shit that he is. Yeah, and I'm, I'm surprised that his army was this small. I thought he had a bigger army, but maybe he lost that many units earlier. He spread his army pretty thin. So these are the guys that you have throwing Thunderfist or Lightning. Yeah. Which is very uh, good. Storm I actually demons. have those. I have two kinds of units that uh, are doing the same thing. I have that one. And I also have those guys. But for some reason, like these, the Shed, those are Berito's uh, national summons. Those were the ones I was going for. But for some reason, they perform like a third as well as the Storm Demons. So I'm not really sure what that's about. That's kind of stupid. It's like, hey, faction-specific one? It's terrible, by comparison. But look at that. It, it might be based on what units I've set them to target, I guess. Nice shot there. Because I think I put them to... Most of them, I think I have to target large units. So they're just throwing shit on his commander. Did you do but this, so, Rigor Mortis? No, I'm not doing any of the spells. Okay. Didn't know. You're just breaking through there. Yep, and now, if you look at the elephants... They're now running over Carlos's or your men. Yep. <laughs> and if you look back on the battlefield, even further back... And see what they're heading towards. Your mage core, nice. <laughs> trample, trample, trample. Yeah, they kill like all of them. Yeah, honestly, I don't like elephants. Arch like elephants are way. And then he's they like, are. Oh, your guys died. But the I thing is, I hate them. The thing is that yes, they are dangerous. However, they did also. Pretty much kill his entire army as well. But it is it was a shame he lost me. Like every single one of the Storm Demon and the Shed Deaths in this battle was from <laughs> my own elephants. <laughs> but like if you look at the kills on the elephants. Seventy eight. Yeah, how many of them are your men? Uh I'm not entirely certain my own men count, but they might. Because if you look at his dudes, he lost 150, what? And I think that roughly counts up to that. So I don't think it counts my own units. Yeah. 
We will have and to the, uh, see how and they the shed only again. got 19 kills while the storm demons got 42. However, like I said, I might have had the storm demons targeting regular troops, and in that case, it that might have had that. a difference there. Yeah, he lost one storm demon, but he lost it to an elephant. Shame, <laughs> most shame. likely. Yeah, <laughs> cannot believe the quiche. Mm -hmm. On to the next battle in Misty Bog. Nothing of interest. Worldwide event has occurred. Upcoming Barina battle. Wheel. Yep. Did you send someone? Uh. Just gotta <laughs> equip him first. Staff of Storms. Is probably better than the than the axe, to be honest. Most weapons are better than the the base weapons. If not only just because it'll do magic damage. Okay, yeah, you are going to the arena. He's like, oh, I'll kill them. It, fucking goddamn Sandor sending a super combatant. This guy's gonna get <laughs> fucking raped. I sent the normal barbarian chief. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Bertos has terrible, terrible commanders. You pretty much have to summon, summon some kind of blood commander, to uh, actually have anything of, of worth to send. But uh, it's... Jesus! All right. Well, here's the here's the deal, my little lad. The bad mm -hmm. guys are everywhere, and it's bad. But. They're not everywhere. <laughs> no, we, we did fight them back at the Macon. No, well, not the Macon front, but the Macon backyard, I guess. Backyard, yeah. They're um, they've been kicked out temporarily, but now that he's got those new forts, that's and they're all max production, or this one is, anyways. Yeah. What I'm a little bit like, I, I was a bit con. Uh, what's the word? Conflicted. Because if you look at the the edge of the Macon Peninsula there, below that there's a fort. I can walk there because it's frozen and I can take it. However, that would also mean that I couldn't move my units back for an <laughs> entire year. <laughs> at the same time, it would to give you another castle. <laughs> I know, but it's like... <laughs> Yeah, but he's building from there. I can't do it. Suicide run. All right. Like, all right. We'll all right, he uh, says. <laughs> we I gotta mean, go. It's the only fucking castle we'll ever take from Atlantis at this point. <laughs> all right, I just need to move some items over. Let's see. Oh, God. Hold on. I'm a thirsty boy. I gotta grab tea in the middle of a fucking recording. Oh, that's embarrassing. <laughs> I could have just done it stealthily while I was doing this, uh, but yeah. You're gonna hear I'm me open also... the fridge though. It's like, <laughs> dunk, dunk, dunk it. What's um, Kibbs doing? Falling down the steps. Well, the other thing that Kibbs did was get the uh, his Whoa. half of his minotaurs is stuck in the mountains. Yeah, so that happened. Frozen over. <laughs> my not half, just my god and the other commander. They're stuck there. Oh, the god there as well. Yeah. Yep, and the rest of them so, are here. So I have two options. I can sit here and wait, or I can just rush him and die. Might win. Yeah. Uh, no, I, I mean, you might, but ooh, against the castle and the promise defense. But he might not be patrolling either. But also, if he isn't patrolling, you'll have to break the walls. And in the meantime, he'll be able to amass more armies that would come in and attack you at the same time. At the same time, I just want to kill him. So, but I'm going to stay here and wait for my god. But, yeah. My god is at that little edge on the uh, Macon Peninsula, and he is going to cast Breath of the Desert on top of the mountains, and we're going to try to heat them up so your god can maybe maybe get out of there. <laughs> maybe. Oh, damn. Gotta beat back Atlantis. But Atlantis is his, his main primary army is over here. 360 dudes. He's gonna try to break my back. So I've got this army here, which is not strong enough to take him yet. 
And I'm trying to get Conjuration up so I can get better summons, but honestly, I may you, not you have still, the time. So I'm just you gonna... still have two turns before he can attack you to get more units, so... That's something. I'm just going to summon some Vine Men. I, I'm not sure I've actually ever seen them. <laughs> so, but, uh... They're kind of terrible, but what I'm hoping that they'll do is they'll just bog him down. Hmm. I summoned a bunch of serpents the other turn. Anyone who has two for us should uh, summon animals. Make sure you have your, your centaurs set up to target rare properly. Because he does have pretty decent mages at this point, and they are doing a lot of damage. Yep. But he also has an entire front line of... Uh, those little coral boys, which will hinder you from even getting there. Cast, 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 cast. No! Oh, I thought I'd, I moved them all. I meant that would cancel. I'm like, no! Because I'm <laughs> I hate them. that. Oh, I wish, I wish this game had an undo button so bad. Me too. Some smokers. No, we can't afford them. <laughs> <laughs> Animals will have to do. Can you do anything while you're sitting there? <laughs> Can <No>. build palisades. <laughs> Fucking worthless. It would be almost hilarious to have him go to the death match instead. And die. And die. <laughs> I mean, yeah, he's a bull. He's pretty strong. He's a tough lad. Yeah. But no, we're sending poor Pylon to his death, so have fun, Pylon. Other than that, poor things Agartha are going okay right failed now. Failed to take back the capital. Agartha's uh, right now. dead. That's <laughs> no, they still have one province. <laughs> <laughs> one pro Start building dudes from there. <laughs> I can't. He has zero gold. <laughs> oh, no. It's okay. I've got your back. I'm sending you nine gold. Hopefully no, that's no. Oh, it's, it's for our god. It has to be done. There you go, buddy. <laughs> there you go. It's like, thank yeah. you for the stuff. So, that's that. Uh, Bertos is lo losing, like, every single province from Atlantis. Stop and Stop losing <laughs> stuff. I'm going to try to take back Minestra next turn, not this turn, because I need to get my army together. Uh, I think I will probably be able to take Carlis there, because my Storm Demons are actually pretty decent there. They might be but able to yeah. beat him back. I'm pretty sure this big army of his is going to start heading south. I'm hoping. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I almost want it to go and kill Nervi. <laughs> <laughs> Just so we can remove him from the little roster here. <laughs> Just like we did from Rila. As the turn, mm -hmm. the faction roster gets smaller and smaller. Alright. I think that's everything. We can jump into the next turn. Yeah, yeah. I think so too. Alright, let's see how sad we're going to be. This is turn 47. We're now at entering midwinter. The fourth year of the war. It's definitely going to five <laughs> years at this rate. I'd have to do yep. something real special to make us call it four or five. <laughs> but I don't think it's going to go on that much longer. No, I think uh, I think we're gonna break soon because I think I think we're at that point where we still have enough fighting power to keep fighting back. Right now. But yeah, because but I of can't Atlantis, see us winning. like there's just too much. Yeah, we can't do shit to Atlantis, so we're fucked. Oh my God, summon so much stuff. Wait, what? Agartha, thank you, bro. <laughs> Dude, for nine gold, that's a pretty good damn deal. All right, so let's see what the arena death match result was. Congratulations, Conan the Median champion. Who, of course, fucking Carlos won. Fuck you, Carlos. All right, let's look at this arena. Oh wait, no, Berto everyone fights each other in the arena. No, I forgot about that. Doesn't matter, we're on the same team. Carlos killed all of his friends. Nice, there's a super combatant, sort of. Look at this. I Three. think the game is over. 
Oh, is it over? What do you mean? I think so. I think all in one. Wait, he won? What do you mean? It says a dire portent in the... at the top. Dire portent? It is foretold in the prophecies that own that before the Lord and Master Spirit Conan, a barbarian king of this king's master of the spring, god of the wildlife, finally vanquishes his enemy and ascends to the throne celestial. He shall grant all of his faithful long and prosperous lives. All ills shall be cured and good health shall be enjoyed by everyone. That prophecy is now fulfilled. The false god of Ulm has blessed his followers with supernatural health. Now he just did a blessing. Supernatural health. Oh, and yeah, that's what it did. It's worded oh. so stupidly, though. <laughs> it's worded like, you won. Oh, by the way, it's just it a. Sounds like that. <laughs> this sets a bad example for your faithful, whom have not received similar benefit from the words. Well, tough fucking shit. <laughs> yeah, here. Um... You know, he just casted a new global enchantment. Gift they of get... health. Plus 10% HP per Dominion, chance of healing afflictions about 10% per Dominion, and aging reduced by half. So yeah, that's what happened. That's kind of sucky. But like the, the... The message that you get when someone wins is pretty similar to that one, I think. Is it now? I think so. Were you looking at the arena battle? Yeah, I looked at them. They're kind of dumb. They're not really worthwhile. He's got glamour. He just sits there and stabs them to death. It's not very fun to watch. Oh, is that what's happening? Yes. <laughs> He's got glamour, so he just sits there and we, everyone misses while they all get stabbed to death. Well, he doesn't just have glamour. Because I do have magic weapons... So, now let's see no, that yours, doesn't affect, then that doesn't affect glamour. You gave you uh, didn't give him nothing though. He's just a barbarian. Well, no. <laughs> He's like I'm the barbarian king. But <laughs> uh, yeah, Carlos did kick him out with a full, with full gear. So everything he could try Pretty hard. <laughs> okay, time to look through the battles. Uh, nothing. Nothing. That's really wish there would be. Ah, uh, nope. Mm, this is a battle. Oh no, you fought his god and you died. Oh, he had his god there. Well, that's sad. My god died. Your god did die, but let's see what happened. Oh, his god also died. <laughs> did you cast that darkness? No. That's gonna suck for your dudes. Wait, you guys aren't. Oh, there they are throwing their lightning. Some good strikes there. Good hit on the god, I think. Those lightning things are pretty cool. You're killing his mage core with those guys, though. Jesus. Yeah, they're really strong. But they're shooting at the god area, which is not the good part. What in god's name was that? Red what? flash. Your god descends on him. Oh my god, he's got... Yeah. I wouldn't be surprised if you killed your god killed him. However, you just took like 24 damage, I think, from friendly fire. <laughs> You guys throwing lightning at his troops. You don't have many troops left, sadly. Yeah. Uh oh. Yeah, this is where your god dies. They're all going for you. <laughs> oh, the problem is these guys are all targeting like single targets when they should be shooting at the bulk. That's terrible! Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> They're slaughtering your own dudes. And God's like, dude, help me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Oh, boy. There is a lesson to be learned here, and that is uh, don't necessarily send things to the rear 
willy nilly. <laughs> oh no, your storm demons have decided to fight. Yeah, that's not gonna go well. Yep. Well, you killed his god at least. Again. Yep. Another battle at the Dawes. Oh, wait, no, we just looked at that there. There we go. Uh, province defense. Province defense. Like, the Shed are still pretty strong in melee, but they have a length zero weapon, which means you get even bigger penalties against spears. So they just get fucked. Looking, nope, that's no, that's one, one battle per turn. That's kind of poopy. No big army battle, sadly. But he's going towards Crystal Fields, which is like, hmm, he's 410 men strong now. Mm hmm. I think I'm still better off not going after him. Oh, yeah, that's right. My Minotaur commander's dead. I forgot about that. <laughs> Wait, if it was on recruitment, then there should be a new Minotaur commander. Technically. There he is. Mm -hmm. Okay, a bunch of wolves and shit. Holy shit, he's got 33 mages over it at your place. Yeah, he's got a huge mage core, and I have, like, only a handful of mages, and if I bring them, these are my researchers, too. So yep. what I'm going to keep doing is I'm going to keep summoning and summoning and summoning and summoning and summoning. Let's just see what kind of spells we can even get these sluts out with. Wow, so sassist. So sassist. Yeah, so specific bell. Spe <laughs> How's it going over there? Bell. Spell. Okay, swarm. Oh, Carlis, you sneaky little bastard. What's that little faggot doing now? <laughs> he, instead of letting me take the fort in Minestra, he tore it down. He, he tore that down. That little bitch. <laughs> That was actually pretty stupid of him. Well, I don't know. If you can't keep it, then... It was stupid of him because all you now you can just walk in and take the provinces and get the gold. Which is even better. Well, I don't know. I, I don't so. know about that. He's going to also demolish Capria, which is also stupid. If any fort he should have demolished, it should have been Capria, honestly. I think that was a very stupid idea. Because now you can just walk in and take both those forests there. And that will be a lot of money right there. Mm. Uh, however, you can move your Minotaurs down now. From the mountain. Yay! So that, that little plan there worked, uh, at least. Did they sneak past me? Uh, I think he might have just been building units there, to be honest. Uh, it's just gonna waddle around there. I don't really care. These provinces are making me a fair bit of monies, but at the same time, I don't really care anymore. <laughs> about them because I don't have enough troops to care. The ones I care about is the ones on the mainland. Hmm. My army is 279 strong. That is not very big by comparison. Yeah. We need to cancel recruitment here. This fort is now lost. And instead, divert that money over here and wherever else we can. Fuck, that's a lot of Minotaurs. I don't really need that many. Are you sure? Can you... Get too many Minotaurs? 
I, I don't know. See, like, I used to think the longbow was good, and now it's like, the minotaurs are like, they're just strong enough to derp down things. And I'm not sure if going with archer spam is worth it. Or getting an uh, ugly longbow centaurs. I mean, I think it is, but... We'll try. It's still better to have more minotaurs than bows, anyway. But, like I said before, at some point, it will be better to have uh, archers as well, because you're... If you have too many melee units, they won't be able to do anything. They're just going to stand there and die from mages and from archers. Hmm. I'm in a very precarious situation. <laughs> 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 well, can't argue with that. <laughs> Make some more minotaurs over there. Why are you going there? Oh, I think I was going to intend to build a fort there. That's not possible. That army there is going to move here, probably. Hmm. Yeah, no, this is honestly just too much crap. Because the coastline is just... There's no strategic, like, planning when it comes to, like, defending. It's, like, water everywhere. <laughs> yeah, no. It's, uh, it's kind of silly. Can't have any more bind men, huh? You little slut. See how it is. Like, I mean, these guys can't command very many magic creatures. Crashers. You know, we don't want to do that. How many... Do the wolves count as... No, they don't. Thank goodness. No, I think they just count as normal units. Let's see. We'll put lions and them. Okay. The fuck? A goat came? Okay. <laughs> Noise. Noise. Alright, we're gonna summon all the fucking furry cunts of the forest to defend our hellhole. <laughs> uh, summon be bog beasts. That might be worth it. We have received nine gold from Pangea. Nuts. You're welcome. <laughs> You're... Now I have four gold because I have an income of minus five. <laughs> Good God. Because we have one unit in uh, Atlant or in your territory that I'm going to suicide right now. Pack of wolves. Just gonna summon a lot of puppers. I don't think anyone has seen as many puppers as I'm summoning. Mm hmm. Oh, man. I have like no units left. I have no commanders that can properly lead my magical units. Uh, <laughs> uh, things are not sad. going well. Don't be sad. <laughs> <laughs> We're only fucked. Maybe a little bit. <laughs> a little bit. <laughs> Grow Fortress. Uh, nope. Okay, we'll go call the wild. I'm on a werewolf pack. Oh my god, I'd rather do that. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on. Where do you do that? What does that? Until. Summon werewolf and a large pack of wolves in a distant land. The werewolf is under the commander of its summer. Well, that's actually cool. I can summon werewolves to attack random fucking assholes. 
Can you do it there? Yeah. Yes, on the other side of the river. Yes. That that can actually be nice because uh, when you summon something like that on a province, I think that engages whoever is in there in battle before they have a chance to move away. But I'm not 100% certain about that. Um, and I think that might help you catch people, like if they're running away and just running around in your territory. I think that's a good a good way to deal with that. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. Maybe. Like, I'm just trying to retake some of the northern coast. The bottom coast is pretty fucked, honestly. Mm. I'm just going to build up as big of an army as I can, and this is going to be sort of my last ditch effort. Yep. If that doesn't work, well, shit. It was a good run, I suppose, but that was about all it was. Mm. I was able to get some ogres out. I almost want to just take my commanders and try to flee the fort and just run away. Uh, yeah. Uh, run away and... and... And join your main army. Because I want to have them go north. This army... Hmm, can they go that way? Yeah, try to join them. Because, honestly, every dude helps at this point. And these guys would just get slaughtered yeah, here. Absolutely. If they can regroup with the rest, that'd be perfect. Yeah. Because that gets me 25 centaur minotaurs in advance. You can have that shithole. I don't want it anymore. <laughs> By the way, you want fire gems still? Or any gems you need? Um, no. I the, the thing is, I don't have enough mages with bear toes to do anything with them. And all of my troops are like wandering around everywhere okay, uh, with means... Macon. I'm so... going to start doing some alchemy just to get myself more earth or nature. Not there, than not one earth. I haven't even site searched, but like I don't need to. I mean, not yet. Now that I'm finally casting spells like a smirt lad. Mm. All the wield. We'll do it again, and we'll do it this time. In that province? That'd be funny. Yes. <laughs> I'm sorry, but that's just funny. But yeah, next game, I am definitely building more mages. And yeah, that's something I uh, learned, too. Because <laughs> I think both me and you, this turn, or this game, we were building, like, regular commanders over and over and over again to ferry troops everywhere. And uh, when I play otherwise, or when I've played, like, bot games now... It should be more like you have one guy who ferries more or less, and all of the other turns should just be pumping out mages and researchers. Yeah, pretty much. That was the mistake we made. But hey, you know, you learn shit. Kind of the yep. point of dominions. Alright, so call of the wield. And within a turn, I will have retaken every province he has taken. Mm hmm. I'm just using all my pans to cast Cal Call the Wild to summon werewolves to... Assuming he didn't bump the garrisons too high, I'm hoping the werewolves will just walk over them. Well, it depends on how many werewolves you summon. That is true. All those pans are working. Yeah, no, I didn't even know how to build pans, because I, I was confused at first, because like, when I click on them and chose them grayed out, I'm like, oh, they're not able to be recruited at all? No, it just means it takes two turns to recruit them, or as many turns to get, you know, their command points. Oh, yeah. Oh, God. I, had I known that, I would have a lot more pans, because I only have, like, four. That's mm -hmm. terrible. I should have more. Oh, well. Whatever okay. should I be doing? Blood hunt? Oh, uh, yeah. Blood hunt. Oh yeah, good. 
grab those territories behind OLA. Yeah. Just get them back. Finally take them from Skeech Skeechkins. Skeechkins? The Vipers? The Vipey. Mm, poor Vipey. The Vapor. Poor. Viper's just such a silly name. <laughs> it's not a very good name. It's actually not a as, much better one. Not as good as Kibbs. No, Kibbs, Kibbs is, is kind of meh. Truly, truly good name. Viper's but, a dumb uh, name. Viper Tech hand, is even dumber. Which is why we gave him the beautiful what's name. What's a good sketchy. name? <laughs> <laughs> just... Sketchy. You remember? He's a sketchy kind of guy. <laughs> it sounds fishy. Oh no. Your capital's within striking distance. I thought you were going to go to save that castle with these guys. Uh, The thing is, I didn't know that his god was there. If his god wasn't there, I would probably have taken him. And what I was doing was uh, I moved those guys down there in case he would try to run away. Because, as we found out earlier, you can't combine two armies from two different players anyway. So, but next turn I'm going to move up and attack with those. Because uh, his god isn't there anymore, and, well, I think I'll be able to take him, but Maybe didn't work there. last time, so <laughs> you never know. Yeah, it's true. Also, he's going to get his god back in, like, three turns. <laughs> He's got he so has, many. Yeah, he has a shitload of level 2 priests just ready. Summon them back. Summon him back. Yeah. Oh well. Either or. I think that'll wrap up another episode of Durbinians. Yep, I think so too. But uh, next turn we will find out. Next turn, the next year will pass and we'll see how good... Uh, how good things are looking, so to speak. Yep. Until next time. Bye-bye.